With the carousel being 100 years old, we have to merge new technology with old technology, and we got to put a wheelchair ramp on this carousel, and we were able to be here when the carousel opened, and somebody came up in a wheelchair and just simply asked us, hey, is it possible for wheelchair guests to ride? It just happened to be the perfect coincidence. Getting to witness our first uh, wheelchair-bound guest riding the attraction was just pure pixie dust. Disney's different from working at other engineering companies because it's an entertainment company. It's not just about the engineering, it's about providing an amazing experience for all the guests. I am a big force for quality. I always believe in quality products. Disney really draws me to that. It's always drawn me to that ever since I was a child. They always have had a quality brand and a quality process and you don't really find conflicts and worries with Disney. It's a place you go to have fun and relax. Collaboration at Disney is different than a lot of other places. I think for me, I was really surprised at how helpful and kind everybody was. So it's great working on teams here because everybody's always willing to help each other. Recently, I had the honor of working on Guardians of the Galaxy Mission Breakout at Disney's California Adventure, and it was one of the highlights of my career so far. Um, I got to be part of the engineering team that helped design the profiles for the vehicles. So all of the vertical motion up and down that you experience during the attraction, that was my design. And we've added in this other component where we have to work with the story and the artistic piece of it. I think that's part of the difference between Disney and other engineering firms is that most engineering firms are very focused on the functionality and the safety and getting a reliable piece to work. Disney does all of that, but we have to also take into account the story and work that into the piece. It's an entertainment engineering firm, not just a regular engineering firm. So rather than the design being focused on what's the most affordable, what's the simplest way to get this done, it's all focused about what does the guest see? What makes this magical? I led a team that worked on the Pandora World of Avatar shaman figure. They worked on analyzing the figure and it was really amazing to see the guests' reactions because when they had seen previews, they weren't sure if it was an animated figure or if it was some type of CGI. Without engineering at Disney, we wouldn't be able to tell the stories that we do. If we have some great technological advance and a real feat in engineering, but it detracts from the story, it isn't what we're trying to serve the public with. Same as if we have too much story, we can't build it within the engineering realm, it won't work either. We have to find a nice balance between the two so that they can enhance each other. The narrative really does drive the function here at Disney. Once you embrace that, you'll have a lot of fun in this job.